Hello everyone, this is Sue Broom and I am here to do the weekly angel card reading for the week of April 2nd through April 8th. I am using the Miracle Messages deck by Joan of Angels. And you can find out more. I did put, um, I put information in the description and you can find out more. So I'm shuffling the cards and I'm setting the intention and I'd like you to do that with me as well, that the perfect cards come up for the week of April 2nd through 8th, 2018, and that they give us all the information that is for our highest good for this week to know, whether we're watching it live or on rebroadcast, or replay, whatever. So I'm gonna hold these just next to my heart. I shuffled them, I haven't pulled the cards yet, but I'm holding them next to my heart. And if you could all hold this intention with me. All right, let's see which cards we have. So I'm fanning them out because none of them popped out when I was shuffling. The way that the cards are is not for the beginning, middle, and end. It is for the entire week. So, holding your intention, let's see what the cards have to say. Okay, so we're all holding this beautiful intention in our hearts. And the first card that we have, and I haven't seen them yet, is the Heart Mobile. Hop on board. Good things happen when your heart leads the way. <clears throat> Excuse me. So this is a week where there is a lot of opening of our hearts going on. And for those of us that feel like there's, you know, maybe we've been hurt a lot in the past. And we've, you know, put this little shell over our hearts. Something that we can do, and this is an exercise I do talk about um, on the Facebook Lives quite often, I think. But if you stand and put your arms straight out and or up as far as you can reach them, and even then put your shoulders back and put your head up and allow the sunlight, the love of the divine to come in, it opens up our hearts. And I think that there's something for so many of us that we do need to open up our hearts just a little bit more because the more we open them up, the more love comes in and the more love that we're able to share as well. So the Heartmobile is with us this week. Call on the angel of the Heartmobile. That's a first card. The second card, ooh, Ancient One Abraham. Ancestral memories. Remember who you are. You have all you need. Call upon us for support. Now this is um, such a beautiful card because it's an ascended master and you can just feel the loving presence of this ancient one. And it also calls on us to pull in the love, not only of our angels, of, our, um, of the ascended masters, but also of our ancestral background. We all have a lot of baggage. Absolutely, I get that. However, there was also a lot of love and a lot of wisdom. And Ancient One Abraham reminds us, when we open our hearts with the heartmobile, it also calls in the love of the Ancient Ones from our ancestors, from the Ascended Masters, from our star being friends. Absolutely. Oh, can't wait to see the third one. The Beloved One. Walk with me. I am by your side. Healing, compassion, and love within you reside. Share your heart. Now, so this is another interesting, and it goes so well with these. I'm going to pull them back a little bit so you can get them all in a little bit better. Uh, do I have them in the right order? Wrong way. Here we go. I might have them backwards, but... You get, you get how, how they go. <laughs> 
So we have the Heartmobile. We have the Ancient One, Abraham. And then we have the Beloved One actually sharing our hearts. So the more we open, the more knowledge and wisdom we are able to take in as well as allowed to be able to um, send out and sharing our hearts. Love this. This also reminds me of loved ones. And there goes one of the cards just fell. This reminds me of our loved ones on the other side. So if this made you think of anyone, you know, you know that they are with you. So have a blessed week, everyone. This is, again, this is Sue Broom for the week of April 2nd through April 8th, 2018. Angel blessings to you.